know, you can look at the bus system as being for those people. But those people also include your parents and your grandparents that did work their entire lives. And maybe they want to age in place. Maybe they want to stay in the home that they've always lived in, but they're up somewhere where bus service doesn't go. And maybe they've never used the fixed route bus, but eventually they will probably get to the point where they may need paratransit or they may need those other human service providers. My elderly parents um, live in Rock Rim and they've lived there for over 40 years. And my mother now has age-related macular degeneration. My dad's 91 and he had to give up driving and they're like stranded because transit doesn't go to that neighborhood. And looking ahead into the future, El Paso County in particular, our aging population is supposed to triple by 2040. So um, right now, I mean, if we think we're maxed out now, give it another 30 years and we're gonna have three times that amount of people that are aging in place and are aging in our community and we won't have the services for them. So I, I think part of our mission is to start now so that 30 years down the road, we've got something to offer those people that have chosen to live in Colorado Springs.